Welcome to Timber's Garden and our little tulip fest. This is the old tennis court garden. And these are stunning apricot with a few Ronaldo. One or two little apricot wallflowers. Look quite good with the emerging rose foliage. That's Olivia Austin. Euphorbias are looking fab. Great time of the year for them. I love the acid green. to the back of the house. More euphorbias. Got some nice tulips here. Yellow spring green with poor sharer. Which is a nice combination, especially with the Pittosporum Tom Thumb. More yellow spring green with Paul Scherer and a nice lemon wallflower. Quite like that combination, it's worked quite well this year. We plant about 2,000 tulips every year, mainly in pots, but we just keep re replenishing a few in the borders. Big cherries flowering nicely at the moment. Now we're on to the back of the house. We've got apricot fox which looks quite nice. It brightens up the lavender beds with the Santa Linas, which this time of the year, they're just coming into growth and tend to look a little bit boring, so it cheers them up a bit. So I plant quite a lot in pots, put lots in them, lots of lasagna planting. This is La Belle Epoque with Ronaldo, Cairo. Um, it looks quite nice against our old brickwork. Past the big greenhouse. It's rather full at the moment. Uh, lots of things that need taking out and hardening off. They've come through the winter quite well. We had a nice mild winter, rather wet, but nice and mild. More Belle Epoque, Cairo, Ronaldo, apricot tulips, which, yeah, looks quite nice with the brickwork. Onto the parterre garden of lemon wallflowers. There's always one yellow one that comes up from the seedlings that shouldn't be there, but uh, never mind. A few yellow, uh, the spring green tulips. Onto the parterre. Ace Grecium looking bark, looking beautiful as usual. Nice cinnamon coloured bark. Great tree, that. Down onto the lower parterre. Quite a sweetie shop looking tulips. Dolls Minuet, Ballerina, 